Are you looking for a way to set up your AirTags with iPhone? Many people in the internet have complained that they are not able to set up their AirTags with the iPhone or iPad. This problem can happen due to various software malfunction and also if it did not fulfill some setting changes on the iPhone or iPad. In this video, we will show you the easy step-by-step -step process to set up your Apple AirTag with the iPhone. And also we will show you what you can do to fix AirTag not setting up. Let's check it out. Before you do anything else, you have to keep in mind if your iPhone is not updated to the latest software or at least running on iOS 14.5 or later, you won't be able to connect the AirTags with your iPhone. To check it out, open settings. Tap General, tap Software Update. If there is any new update pending, update it. If you fulfill this criteria, when you bring your AirTag close to your iPhone, you will get a pop-up. Tap Connect. Now you can name the AirTag various things like your backpack, keys, headphones, etc. Choose the thing you are tagging. Tap Continue. Select Use this iPhone. Tap Continue. When the setup process is completed, tap done and it is connected to your iPhone. Now if you are not able to set up your AirTag with your iPhone, you have to make sure your iPhone's Wi-Fi and Bluetooth is turned on because they are very important for the setup process. Then you have to make sure your iPhone has good internet connection when you are trying to set up your AirTags. Wi-Fi or cellular data does not matter. Anyone will do and if you are having problem with either, you can switch to Wi-Fi or cellular or vice versa. If Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and cellular data were on for a long time, it can cause problem with the connection. So turn them all off, wait a bit, then turn them back on. It should fix the issue. Make sure your Apple ID's two-factor authentication is on. If it is not on, you won't be able to connect your AirTags to iPhone. It is very important. Also, if you are using a managed Apple ID, such as specialized Apple IDs created by educational institutes for students, won't work to set up AirTags, as they are different from regular Apple ID. If your Find My is not enabled with your iPhone, your AirTags won't work, so make sure it is turned on. Open Settings. Select your name banner, select Find My, tap on Find My iPhone, make sure all the options are toggled on. Now go back, open Find My app and make sure it is set up. Location services needs to be turned on to use AirTags. Go to Settings, select Privacy, select Location Services. So make sure it is on. Now scroll down and select Find My. Make sure the settings is to while using the app and precise location is turned on. If you have a used AirTag or you have previously connected the AirTag with another device with a different Apple ID, check if it is already connected to the previous Apple ID or not. If it is, it won't be able to set up with the new device. So make sure it is disconnected from the previous Apple ID. Open Find My in the other device. Select Items. Select your AirTag. Tap Remove Items. Tap Remove. And it will be deleted from the older Apple ID. And you will be able to connect it with the new iPhone. Sometimes this problem can happen if your iPhone has some software glitch which can prevent it from connecting to AirTags. Simply give your iPhone a forced restart. It will refresh your iPhone settings and fix any software glitch. Quickly press and release the volume up button then volume down button. Now press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. So guys, this is the way you can connect your AirTag to iPhone and also fix the problems with AirTag not setting up with the iPhone. Thanks for watching the video. We hope it was helpful. If you have any query on the topic, let us know in the comment box and always stay with our channel. Thank you.